the rhinestone detail on the shoe um, with the clear fabric. Oh, I can't remember the name of the. <laughs> I'm having a moment already. It's too early. Hey guys, what's up? It's Monica and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a luxury haul slash holiday outfit ideas and it's a really good one. So um, yeah, we've got tons of goodies that I picked up. We've got tons of outfits that I'm going to share with you guys. But before we jump into all of that, if this is your first time visiting my channel, I'm Moni and I'm a fashion and lifestyle blogger based out of Atlanta. And if you love fashion, fashion, and more fashion, make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. Um, also, if you're on Instagram, make sure you follow me, it's all by Moni. So in between the hauls and the vlogs and whatnot, you get tons of style inspo, great photography, so make sure you check me out, it's odd by Moni. It's odd by Moni on TikTok as well. Um, and also don't forget to check out my website, oddbymonica.com for tons of style inspo what to wear to church to lunch to brunch to work all of that good stuff you'll find that on the what would money wear page but yes this video it's super fun um, I picked up a lot of really cool things um, in addition to that I have a cool partnership with Jay McLaughlin I've worked with them in the past you guys have seen some of their stuff um, in some of my hauls but I'm going to share about five holiday looks with you guys for various occasions these outfits are amazing they include what I'm wearing now which I absolutely love and I can't wait for you guys to see it because yeah it's that good anywho I'm going to share all the looks I kind of filmed this a little differently it's a little bit more relaxed as opposed to the normal hauls that I do where you've got the backdrop and all that but I just really wanted to run through the outfits with you guys and just share why I love these pieces and why Jamie McLaughlin has tons of great holiday um, pieces as well so let's jump right into that and then I will share all the goodies that I've picked up in the last few weeks let's get into it okay so First, we've got this gorgeous cashmere sweater. I am completely obsessed with the color. The button detail on the sleeve, amazing. It feels amazing on. Um, I'm obsessed. I love the fact that it's more of a relaxed turtleneck, so it just really frames the face really well. Um, and it's absolutely stunning. And then this skirt, everything. So it is a wrap skirt, which I love. You've got the buttons on the side. You've got the fringe detail, which is very much on trend, but also very classic and chic. And then the skirt also has two gray lines just running through it. The length is pretty awesome. It's also a very high rise. So I just love it. Very chic, very cool. I'm also wearing these beautiful suede booties. Oh, not booties rather, but <laughs> knee high boots. Love them. Absolutely beautiful. The heel is not too high, but I love Love this um, heel length you guys have seen these boots in another haul I shared them with you guys um, and I just love them um, this look would be perfect for dinner a family gathering during the holidays Christmas Eve Christmas Day I feel like the possibilities are endless this is just a great holiday outfit that you can use to that you can wear rather to host friends um, to go for a nice dinner to meet up with co-workers and after the holidays you can wear it to work or whatnot but I just love this look it is very chic easy to wear very comfortable and I'm here for it on to the next okay so next look uh, is this not the perfect travel for the holidays or I'm going shopping for the holidays look I don't know what is like oh my goodness I'm so obsessed every detail okay first the poncho it is let me take the scarf off so it doesn't take away from the poncho so you guys can really see what's going on here how flipping gorgeous is this poncho it's got kind of like that link detail. You've got the fringe on the sides. The color, it is just so chic and rich. I love this. And it is very comfortable. I'm just wearing the same um, cashmere sweater that we already, that you guys saw. 
under it but um just kind of to complement all the brown and the ivory going on but it is just beautiful so i have these um leggings on and they feel amazing the color is everything in this beautiful brown just absolutely stunning and then we've got these classic croc emboss with the bamboo detail loafers. I'm obsessed with these shoes. They are very comfortable. Um, I feel like brown and ivory is just so chic. It looks absolutely amazing and I am here for it. I truly adore this look. Like how gorgeous is this? It is just so chic, so comfortable. Another perfect for hosting if you're gonna travel and you wanna be comfortable but chic. This is a great travel look. Um, the, the possibilities are endless with an outfit like this. I just love all these pieces. And I feel like a poncho also makes a great holiday gift. So if you guys need a great gift, make sure you actually go to Jay McLaughlin's website because they've got tons of holiday gift ideas. So I feel like something like this would be great. It's like a one size fits all. I think they might have one or two sizes like a small medium or a medium large but it's just a great gift you can't go wrong with it it's so chic and you can do so much with it like I would wear this with ripped jeans I would wear it has is the possibilities are endless so I feel like this is a great gift idea so yes I love this and then let me show you guys the scarf real quick and I'll go to the next look so the scarf is humongous and I love it I've been looking for an oversized scarf like this for a while and this one is absolutely beautiful. You've got the chain detail. You've got the, hor like, the horse bits and all of that. I think it's absolutely beautiful. So I kind of just um, folded the scarf in half to just throw it over the poncho. This you can do with a coat or with a poncho, with a blazer, with a shirt. The possibilities are endless in terms of how you can style a beautiful scarf like this. I'm wearing it has a shawl over the poncho just to add a little bit more interest also if i'm outside and it's a little cold this is a nice way to add one more layer without looking overly bulky um so yeah i'm here for it it's just so beautiful the scarf also makes for a really great holiday gift as well but like i said this look is just everything it is so chic i'm here for it okay let's go to the next one it's so beautiful i love it i love it just just keep on watching my vlogs because you guys know i'm gonna be wearing this like all holiday season so yeah love okay on to the next all right oh can we have a moment for this look the skirt oh my goodness i love it let me get up closer so you guys can just see the detail like look at that oh my goodness beautiful and it does have its own waistband it's um it kind of mimics the stripes in the skirt but i put this belt over it this belt is gorgeous um, it's actually reversible, so you can wear it this way with the gray, or you can flip it around and wear it has red. It's a red. It's red on the inside, which actually is perfect because it can match with um, one of my bags. But um, I love it. Like I love every detail. I love this sweater. Oh my goodness, beautiful navy button detail, just like the other cashmere sweater. Um, yeah, it's the skirt for me. It's the whole look for me, to be honest. And then the shoes. They are black suede, but they've got a tortoiseshell heel, which is chunky, so it's nice and comfortable. And I've got big feet, and my feet feel very comfortable in this. Sorry, the light just did something funny. <laughs> but my feet feel extremely comfortable in the shoes. This look is just gorgeous. It's clean, it's simple, but it's extremely chic, and I love that. I love outfits that just are chic they're not too fussy I love fuss don't get me wrong but I also have moments where I just want to feel beautiful and chic and elegant and timeless and that's what this look is giving me and if you want to add a little style twist or make it a little bit funky or you know a bit more casual you can always um, lose the pumps and just add combat boots so keep that in mind but I'm obsessed with these pieces especially this skirt <gasps> I love I love it I love it Okay, on to the next. Okay, guys, don't forget to let me know which outfit is your favorite and which item is your favorite as well. But oh, I'm just obsessed with it all so far. There's still two more looks before I jump into the luxury haul. So yes, just keep on watching. But I'm truly, truly obsessed with this. It's so pretty. Okay, on to the next. Okay, so the next look I love. 
everything is kind of has that silk sateen feel very silky beautiful great fall to the look I love these pieces oh my goodness these pants are high rise um, normally I would tuck them in but I feel like the vibe I'm getting with this look is more I'm hosting friends I want to be very comfortable it almost has that elevated you know lounge wear kind of feel to it because these pieces are very comfortable but yet they're very dressy um, these pants are absolutely beautiful I love the print on them with the chain or the gold detail with the chain and the loops and all of that really fun and then the shirt it's beautiful it just feels like butter like literally feels like butter um i just wanted it to hang that's why i didn't tuck it in but if you rather have the rise show definitely tuck in scrunched up the sleeves a little bit to show off some arm candy left up open um, a few buttons just kind of you know show off the chain necklace to kind of complement the detail on the pants and then we have these beautiful sandals which are in tortoiseshell which i really love they've got the chunkier heel so they're nice and comfortable um and when you walk you'll just really get more detail of the shoe and when you walk you'll that's when you'll really see the detail of the shoe but the overall outfit is just really beautiful it's very chic very elevated that's really the vibe of this look. If you're going to like a dinner party, I feel like this is great for a holiday dinner party. The pants actually have a matching bag. One second, let me, let me get the bag. Oh my goodness, how cute. So like, if this is not the perfect dinner look, I don't know what is, like, gorgeous. I love, I love little details like that when, you know, you've got the matching bag to a piece of your outfit. I just feel like it's just so elevated and chic and I'm here for it. Like, how cool is this? Going for dinner, friend's house, dinner at a restaurant, whatnot. It's just the perfect look for the season. I love it. And I love the matching clutch. It's such a vibe. Yay. Okay, so this next look, I had to throw in a white dress shirt because I love white shirts. You guys know this. Um, and this one is a little oversized. I love the length of it. That's why I'm not tucking in. Um, but I um, definitely undid the cuffs to kind of roll them up. That way you can show off your arm candy. I only also have about two or three buttons done. Um, so kind of if you have any jewelry, you can just peep through. And then you can see a little bit more of the rise of these gorgeous jeans. Look at that. They, they've got that print, the chain print. I love. Like how friggin' cute. So for the denim... They are a little short for my length. I'm about 5'6", and if I'm correct, I have a size 4 in this. I will have the sizes and everything obviously popping up. But, um, yeah, so I have, I have to kind of pull them down a little bit so they're not high-rise, they're about here. And they do have pockets, they're slip pockets. So I pulled them down a little lower so they can be longer because I love length. And then I'm pairing them with those fabulous black tortoiseshell pumps that I shared and I feel like this look is really for that person who doesn't want to be overdressed who loves denim who wants this to look very put together for the holidays maybe hanging out with friends or just being at home and meeting up with people or whatnot but this is just a very chic very elegant look I love it you can never go wrong with a white dress shirt um just classic and look at the way it just complements the denim and complements the overall look and for a bag how cute is this? It's got the tortoiseshell detail that you find on my shoes. So you have this really cool bag, oversized clutch, which we all love very much on trend. And now you have a great look. Like I'm meeting up with friends for dinner. I am running errands. I'm doing whatever I want to do in this look during the holidays, but I want to look very chic and put together and I'm here for it. I love this look. Let me hold this bag properly so you guys can get the full vibe. So yes, this is the full look. How cute. Oh, and the bag has feet too. It has feet, so really cool feature. And it isn't like a faux suede fabric, which it looks really good. It feels great, but it's the tortoiseshell detail for me. I love a good tortoiseshell detail. I just feel like it adds interest to whatever it's paired with. And 
the bag, the shoes, no exception. I love this. It's a classic. Yay. All right, guys, there you have it. Those are the pieces that I got in from Jay McLaughlin. Um, I love them all. I do have a few other pieces, but you guys have to watch my Instagram and you have to check my vlogs to see how I style all the other pieces because there's a lot. They sent me a lot. The brand was very gracious, so thank you so much to Jay McLaughlin for sponsoring this portion of the video. This was so much fun. Clearly, you know, I love all these pieces, so make sure you keep on watching my stories and following along because I will style the hell out of all these pieces. They are amazing. All right, now let's get into this luxury haul. So how fabulous were those outfits, right? Like, I literally am obsessed with everything. I... I don't even have enough events, but I'm like, I'm gonna find events to wear all the pieces. I'm obsessed. I don't even know what's my favorite. I think this might be my favorite look. You guys, don't forget to let me know which of those outfits were your favorite. Um, but yes, I love, love this. I actually think I'm gonna wear this all day today. And then just make sure I don't get it dirty so I can wear it again. Anywho, luxury haul. So I picked up about 10 pieces. Um, that I'm going to share with you guys. I actually have a few more things on their way and some things just didn't get to me on time. Oh my god, I ordered these um, Mason Mar um, Margella jeans. I cannot wait to share them. But they're arriving today, just not on time. Actually, no, they're not even arriving today. They're arriving tomorrow. And I finally got a pair of Antico um, sl slides. I'll have a picture pop up. Um, and I'll share them with you guys eventually in the halls or vlogs or whatnot, but I cannot wait to wear them. I just hope they fit my big feet because I wear a size 42, so I'm not even sure if they're going to fit or not, but I'm excited about them. Anywho, the things that I have now that I'm going to share with you, we're going to start with this beautiful Prada hat. It's in nylon. I love it. Funny enough, I don't know why I've been on a hunt for baseball hats for so long, um, and I just never got around to picking up one so when I was in New York I went to the Prada store and I saw and actually they didn't even have it on display I was just asked like you know do you guys have any hats or whatnot and they had this and I'm very happy about it I love it I've worn it quite a few times already and I think I've only had it for like two weeks but very functional very comfortable you've got the velcro um, detail at the back so it's just an easy on and off you just have the Prada logo on the side so it's not terribly in your face and it's in their classic nylon fabric I love this this is a great piece to wear casually dressed up dressed down I actually styled it a few different ways I think already in my um outfit of the day series if you guys are not watching the outfit of the day series you guys are really missing out because I'm taking the pieces from the halls I'm taking the pieces that you guys have seen more dressed up and I'm wearing them every day in real life more casual um, and more comfortable so make sure you check out my outfit of the day series for more style inspo and it's just very laid-back it's me in real life basically without all the makeup and all the whatever so make sure you check it out but anywho I love this hat it's a great purchase if you are contemplating getting one of these I say go for it they are definitely on the pricier side I think this one was just right under $500 um, but I feel like a piece like this I'll have forever so why not but love it on to the next okay so the next item I picked up um, these boots I feel like you guys have seen the, seen the boots I've shared these boots also in a haul of my friend. I can open the box. That'd be good. <laughs> so I, I don't know if you guys would recall, but I mentioned that I had these Balenciaga booties that I've had for a while, and I love them, but they're just not comfortable. So I wanted to replace them, and I ended up getting this pair. I love them. I love the heel height. It's not too high, but it also goes in, so it's very sexy. It's got a very sexy silhouette to it, and it's a little thicker, so it's you know it's nice and stable then you've got your square-ish pointy toe um I'm into the square toe thing but I don't like when it's too square especially in a boot I just feel like it looks sloppy but this it's still narrow but then it's square right at the tip so I feel like that's a bit more put together a bit more elegant in my opinion and then I also love this padded detail with the round detail there it's just a very simple sexy silhouette it's in a fabric and an almost like a nylon but it has like a seam a sheen finish to it um, very comfortable easy to wear I love them they're very dressy I styled them a few different ways if, if I'm if I recall and I'll have a picture if I can if I have an image I'll have it popped up pop up rather but yes love these boots great piece um, I hope they're still available I will link everything that is available guys so don't you know for sure I will link everything but I'm obsessed with them they are a great purchase 
and if you are contemplating or I would say 100% all the way and I did a 41 so you know I can go between a 41 42 these are a 41 and they're very comfortable and the name of the brand is Neos Neos so love these on to the next okay so the next item I picked up um, it's not fashion but it's still luxury and it is this I know you guys are like what the hell is that <laughs> so if you're Nigerian this and your Yoruba, this does this is Ayo, the game which my parents used to play. It was in wood and you kind of have stones and you kind of pick them around and put them down or whatever. But so I got this from CB2 and they call it um Mankala. I hope I said that right. Um and it's in marble. I say it's luxury because it costs $150 for a game. I think that's expensive. That's just me. <laughs> but it's beautiful because I feel like in addition to it being a game, it's also a great decor feature. So for those of you who've been rocking with me, you know I'm obsessed with home decor. Um, so I'm always looking for fun little pieces to kind of add to the home. Um, and this, I just feel like, is everything. I think I'm actually going to do a blog post about different games that are just beautiful and also serve as decor pieces. I bought quite a few last year and I'm adding this one to the collection of the items that I have. Let me know if you guys want to see that blog post and I can like share about 10 to 15 amazing games that are just absolutely beautiful, are great for the home, are clean, modern, classic and just look amazing. So yes, this marble one I love. It comes with um, the beads that you use to kind of, you know, go around and whatnot. Um, I'll share with you guys. And the cool thing, there's silver beads and there's gold beads. So I guess whatever your home aesthetic is. So that's what the beads look like. I'm going to put a few in and then kind of try and zoom in so you guys can see. But they're literally like, I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah. <laughs> they're like beautiful silver beads and it comes with its little pouch so you guys don't lose the beads. It's just a beautiful fixture, and I love it. I feel like it's just going to sit on my coffee table. It's going to look beautiful, um, and I'm here for it. I don't know if you guys can really see that, but that's just a few. There's four in each slot, and I'm just going to have it sit on the table like that. So it's really, really pretty. I love it. Um, but, yeah, I got that, and I'm very happy with it. So now let's get to the next item. All right, so I've got another pair of shoes. Um... I don't know if you can call Schultz luxury. I think it's luxury. It's expensive enough. 200 and something dollars. It's still expensive. But I love these shoes. You guys have seen them. And I think you've seen them in a haul. I did use this for... I used them for my um, last shoot in New York as well. I love these boots. Like, that heel is just so sexy to me. Gorgeous. And a classic pointy toe. But you do have almost like a western vibe with this shoe. I really, really love these. They're in suede, but it's almost like the suede has, has a matte finish to it, so it's not a grainy suede. Um, it's almost like a polished finish with the suede, and I, there's a term for it, but I cannot remember right now for the life of me. But they are comfortable. They look great. They're a dressier pair. I feel like you can dress them up, dress them down, but for the most part, they are more on the dressier side. But I love this, you know, classic, beautiful, sexy meets western on top silhouette of the boots and i'm here for them um great piece i love them i will continue to wear them i they look great with skirts with dresses with leggings the possibilities are endless so yeah i'm obsessed with these oh i think i have a few pictures i know i have a picture of this where i wore it in new york so i'll have that pop up really cute right <laughs> okay on to the next love Okay, so the next item I got, another hat. I picked this up in New York as well. If you guys watched the vlog, you probably saw it. Um, did I? I think I wore it in the vlog. Make sure you watch my New York vlog. It's a really good one. <laughs> um, but yes, I love this hat. So I have to say, I saw it first on Tamara. I can't remember her last name. But I, she had the black version of this. It's a tweed Saint Laurent. And the Saint Laurent had like a, I, I feel like it had the white piping around the S and L. And I thought it was just the cutest thing. And I'm like, okay, I want that hat. So when I was in New York, I went to the Saint Laurent store and I saw the white and black version. I was just like, 
But then I was like, well, I really wanted the black one, but then I tried it on and I was just like, yeah, it was the one. Plus, it's perfect with my Chanel 19 in the black and white. See, like, I know it's such a perfect match, but twee black and white, twee black and white, and then the distance between, it just works, right? <laughs> Anywho, I love the hat. It's a great hat. Um, I am somewhat allergic to wool, so every now and then it'll bother me a little bit. So if you're allergic to wool, keep that in mind. Well, if you're allergic to wool and if you want to get the hat, keep that in mind. It might bother you. But for the most part, I wore it to travel. I've worn it numerous times already. And it's not the end of the world bother, but I just, I know it's there. So um, keep that in mind if you decide that you want to get the hat. But otherwise, I love it. I love the fact that it's black and white. I've been able to wear it with a lot of different things already. And I'm very happy I made this purchase. So yes, love. I will link this one as well as the black and white one just in case you are interested. So yeah, love. On to the next. Okay, so the next purchase, I got these shoes from Aquazara. I love them. So they literally just came in, so I'm not sure in terms of size, because I did get them in a 41, and if I recall, my other Aquazaras are 42, but they didn't have these shoes in a 41, so I figured, you know what, we'll give it a shot anyways. But guys, are these not friggin' amazing? I know I love my comfortable shoe, but I feel like I always have to have at least one, like, showstopper heel and this this is it the silver leather the rhinestone detail on the shoe um with the clear fabric oh, i can't remember the name of the <laughs> i'm having a moment already it's too early but yes this clear material uh, i wouldn't call it a plexiglass but it's also it's almost like a rubber gosh i'm like cannot remember the name of this fabric for the life of me but anywho you guys can see gorgeous 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 shoe beautiful you've got their gold emblem detail at the back nice clean nude heel I mean sole um, this is just a beautiful shoe I'm absolutely obsessed I only hope and pray that it fits otherwise I will have to take it back take them back but they're just stunning Stunning. This, in my opinion, is just such a classic silhouette. Like, there will be no time in history where a silhouette like this will not be in. Like, it's just beautiful, classic, timeless, stunning. Perfect for the holidays, right? I love it. So, yeah, I'm going to try them on later after this. I have a photo shoot after this video, so I got them for the shoot and then to wear it throughout the holidays. So, I'm hoping that they fit because these are absolutely gorgeous. I love these. I'm obsessed. On to the next. Okay, so the next item is this beautiful scarf that I got from Hermes. I'm obsessed with this scarf, and I'm going to show you why. First of all, the colors are everything. Absolutely beautiful. Just a gorgeous, gorgeous scarf. I love these rich winter colors. You've got the oranges, the navy, the chocolate. It's just absolutely beautiful. And then another detail is you've got this beautiful, where is her face? You've got this beautiful black queen on the scarf. I love it. I don't know if she's African or Indian, but this brown skin girl just looks gorgeous, rich, and I'm here for it. I love this scarf. I feel like everyone, if you are a scarf collector like I am, this is one to have. Like how beautiful. So you really have to look at the scarf because the, the eye is right where the, her eye is right where the flowers are, then her lips are there. And I think this is like a headpiece, but it's just beautiful. So rich, great piece. I wore this to travel already. Um, I will wear it nonstop because this is just a beautiful scarf in my opinion. It looks great with browns, with creams, with anything really. Oh, with pinks. I love it. Love it. And if you're one to, you know, wear scarves like tops and stuff like that, you can definitely wear this as a top when it gets a little warmer outside. But this is just a great piece to have, in my opinion. I am truly obsessed with this. On to the next. All right, so I had to pick up something from Chanel. Well, I didn't have to, but this was kind of like a fluke, and it came my way, and I just couldn't say no. 
my girl Layla hooked a sister up. If you guys are following me on Instagram, you've seen these already. So guys, if you're not following me on Instagram, make sure you follow me on Instagram. Because we talked about these shoes, we talked about uh, a new Fendi first color. Not for me, but yeah. Anywho, follow me on Instagram. But yes, can we have a moment? Because, <gasps> Dad, I love them, they're so pretty. Am I the only one who gets this much joy when you find something that you absolutely love? Like, these are friggin' insane. Like, the sole, the wooden detail, just, I'm, I'm fanatic to detail when it comes to fashion. Maybe not everything else in my life, but when it comes to fashion, the details get me every time, especially when I'm paying this price point. I need to see detail. Um, I need to see things that just really stand out. Workmanship, detail, fabric, all of that matters. And these are everything. Everything. First of all, we've got the Chanel um, logo chain thing going on here. I like it because there's a chain under it, so you really have to kind of look to see that it actually says Chanel. Um, and I think that's really cool. It's there's a subtlety to it if that makes sense You can actually they kind of move a little bit actually so that's really fun. It's in patent leather, which I love um, The silhouette of this is definitely a bit more classic timeless So they're very different from my Prada loafers, which I'm very happy about then you also have the Chanel logo right at the back Which is there's you know a little bit of subtlety to it. It's still there But it's you know, there's for the most part I feel like when you're walking your pants will cover it whatnot but if you want it to show it shows at the same time so when i wear this with stirrups it's everything's gonna be out there but with pants you know it's just when you walk that those details will show which i love um it's they're beautiful i got these in a size 42 only because my girl hooked me up she called me actually she messaged me she's like girl i have a 42 in the loafers for you do you want them because we were looking for the dr ones which i never found because they just didn't have my size but she sent me the picture at first I didn't even I didn't respond I was just like oh man she's coming again I don't, I don't need to be shopping but I went in to the store with a friend who was looking at some Fendi first bags and she brought them out and I was just like really dude like how do you say no these will be in my closet forever like literally forever because they are timeless they're classic everything I love them I'm so impressed and I'm so obsessed and I'm so happy I have them. And I can't wait to style them for you guys a hundred and different, a hundred and one, I said a hundred and different, a hundred and one different ways, so stay tuned. But yes, these are mine. I love them. They're not going anywhere, but into my closet with everything else, so yay. <laughs> yay. On to the next. So the next items, they're all from one brand. I'm actually doing a partnership with this brand, but for me, this is kind of full circle because I used to sell this brand and it, you know when you sell something long like years ago and you're just like well I just can't afford it <laughs> but when the brand now reaches out and like yeah they want to partner with you you're just like hell yeah um, and a lot of these brands that at least the brands that I work with are really gracious they let me pick what I love as opposed to just what they want to push and I was so happy when Judith Ripka reached out to me and you know they wanted to kind of promote their holiday stuff so they were you know they were so gracious they let me pick what i loved and guys like can we have a moment for this ring diamonds mother of pearl like like how friggin amazing oh my god i hope you guys can see that and see the detail Oh, isn't it so pretty? Isn't it so pretty? I love it. I'm shooting the rings right after I tape this, but I'm obsessed. And in addition to this ring, let me share what else I got. I feel like I need to take everything else off. So they sent me this ring as well. Also has the diamonds and whatnot going on. Beautiful piece, really subtle. Um, I will wear this every day. Let me take my ring off. It's just beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, I love it. And we have one more thing that I got from them. And when you guys follow, well, when you follow me on Instagram, you'll see everything. Um, and you'll see the images because they're going to be amazing. Um, I plan out all my 
shoots in advance just so they go smooth and I don't have the hassle of you know trying to figure stuff out as I go along but um, yeah I'm gonna put the earrings on for you so all these pieces are from the same collection absolutely beautiful with the mother of pearl and with the diamonds oh look at that I need to take the tag off um, but yeah like I said I'm shooting this like right now so I'm just gonna keep them on for the rest of the video actually I just need ear I need scissors to take off the tag if I'm gonna keep them on Emily, mean, could you pass me scissors? That could be like a new fashion thing. Just have like, you know, your scissors or your tags on. And I hope I'm not cutting my ear. <laughs> okay. Yeah. See what I mean? Like, are they not gorgeous? Oh, I love these. I love them. Like, I am obsessed. So we've got the rings, we've got the earrings, yay! Oh, I love these. They're so pretty. Yes. Yeah, so this is what I got. Another, uh, you know, another item I got these from Judith Ripka. I love them. I'm probably gonna do the rest of the video like this. <laughs> Anywho, I love these. These are a great holiday gift to self, or if you want to gift someone, the ring, the earrings, classic love. Okay, last but not least, I got these fun earrings from Shop Bob. Sashi, Sashi, I think is the name of the brand. I think these are so cool. I don't have anything like this that kind of just drops. So when I'm wearing strapless pieces or things that are just, you know, I don't have anything on my chest and I want a statement earring, this is a great piece to have. So I picked up these earrings as well. I love them. Um, yeah, they're super fun. Love. When you follow me on Instagram, you'll see these in action because the outfit that I'm wearing them with, you're gonna die. Anywho, you gotta follow me on Instagram for that. But yes, guys, those are the new and items I just picked up. Like I said, I have some more things coming, but they just didn't get to me on time for this. Some things that I picked up during um, Black Friday. Let me know if you guys bought anything for Black Friday. I, I felt like this year was kind of like a ripoff. Like there was really no good sales, honestly. So I really didn't buy anything. The only thing that I bought was full price. So I was just like, whatever. But anywho, let me know if you guys found good stuff. What did you do with the sales? I know there were quite a few things that I had featured that were on sale during Black Friday. So I hope, you know, if you guys are inspired, that was your opportunity to pick up at a discounted price. And it looks like they're going to continue to extend these sales. So, you know, I feel like now's the time to shop if you really feel the need to because brands are having great deals across the board. But anywho... Thank you so much for watching, guys. Those are the new and items I got. The outfits are amazing. I'm so thankful to um, Jay McLaughlin for sponsoring that portion of the video and just sending me all these amazing things. Like, I really don't need to shop. I need to do another closet haul because these pieces are amazing. Like, I'm set for the holidays. Um, I hope you guys are inspired um, to create fabulous looks this season and to just have fun with fashion. Um, as always, thank you so much for watching. Guys, if you're not following me on Instagram, make sure you follow. It's Odd by Moni. Make sure you follow me on TikTok, Odd by Moni as well. And don't forget to check out my website, oddbymonica.com for tons of style inspo, home decor inspo. Um, also, make sure you guys check out my new YouTube page on the website. You can literally shop all the key items in the videos on my website now. Check out the What Would Monty Wear page for tons of style inspo. Um, and just get lost there because, you know, I invested a lot in the website and I would really love for you guys to check it out and to just utilize the page. So let me know if you go and what you think about the website. But yes, thank you so much. Till next time. Bye, guys.